Hi, my name is Luke Mahale, and I'm the Youth and Young Adults Pastor here at Clovercrest Baptist Church. In 2012, before my time, the church released this Building for Impact document. This document really outlines the vision that we had to expand our four walls to create a more welcoming atmosphere for every demographic in the community. One of the primary initiatives of this vision was the building of a youth room. A youth room is vitally important because it creates a space where our young people can feel like they can invite their friends, but also that they can really own it for themselves. Another initiative of the building plan was to build a common room, a space for some of the more mid-sized groups, which sits right above the youth room. A big part of this vision for the youth room is a drop-in center. A drop-in center has this amazing way of inviting people who are unchurched, young people who don't know Jesus, to come into this space where they can feel supported, they can get guidance, and they can just hang out with leaders and other followers. You see, the facts are there. We surveyed a bunch of churches in this area who all have youth rooms, and they noticed a dramatic increase in youth buy-in and youth attendance. You see, the reality is a drop-in center will reach a large number of people who have not felt the touch of Jesus Christ in their lives. We need to really acknowledge and embrace the fact that the young people in our church are the next generation and it's becoming harder and harder to be a follower of Christ in this world. So we need to really invest in our young people in a real tangible way. Let me show you the areas that will be affected by these changes. I'm going to show you now the grade 5-6 area. This is used for zone 56 on a Sunday morning and exchange on a Friday night. As you can see, it's not a huge area and it gets really, really busy and really cramped really quickly. So we want to transform this area as well as the room right here to make sure that we create a big space that's open for children, youth, young adults and any other ministry or group who wants to utilise this area. The new youth room will be split into two sections. You might recognise this room as the old prayer room. This will be half of it. So what you see here will be this place where we can have fun. We'll have foosball, we'll have pool tables, opportunity where we can really connect in a real vibrant and fun atmosphere. And the door will be coming through here, which will be going through to the old multi-purpose storeroom. So let's have a look in there now. And here we have the other half of the new youth room. As I said, the doors will come through here from the old prayer room, and here we're gonna have a lounge sort of atmosphere. Couches, coffee, but a chance that we can really connect and talk about the things that truly matter, which is all about Jesus. Whether you're a youth, whether you're a parent, maybe you're a parent of a child who's going into youth in the coming years, we would love you to journey with us. Whether that's through finances, whether it's through prayer, we'd love to really discuss this and chat with you. So will you journey with us? We look forward to it. Bless you.